So a pretty excellent feature of Enterprise Architect is the relationships matrix. So the other way of creating a relationship between elements is to use this matrix. So how do we get there? We go to trace, we go to relationships matrix, opens it up. So you basically have a Y axis and the X axis. The X is the target and the Y is the source. So let's say, for instance, I would love my um, my source to be the role. So I drag the package with the roles as my source. And I would like to have my players as my target. Drag them in there. Cool. So now you can see basically here, um, Abby has a relationship. This up arrow means Abby has a relationship to Baker. Um, Evert has a relationship to Butcher. Cool. So this is the existing relationships. Cool. So I want to say, and this relationship is for the set source to target. So basically, source, this, the baker has a relationship to Abby. And if we say target to source, Evert has a relationship to the baker. Target to source, source to, you need to understand where the relationship comes from. But let's say, for instance, I want to see both. So up, down, down arrows. And I want to actually create a new relationship between James, which is me. I want to say I'm a brewer. I just right click there and I say create news. I say from source to target. Yes, I want the target to source, actually, target to source to be association. So now you can actually see that I have, let's look at my name. So under roles for players for James, let's look at traceability. You'll see that I'm a brewer, but let's say I want to add another role for me, butcher. So now, if I look at me again, I will now be a butcher. So that's how you can create a relationship using the matrix. You can also do holding shift in, right click, and you say do this and find this. So now you can do a lot of relationships. So now I just created a shitload of relationships. Excellent!